back to my channel. I have just received a cold delivery and I thought I would show everyone what I picked up. Sorry about all the mess in the background. My kids are just, you know, I let them do anything they want so I can get these videos out. <laughs> um, so yeah, I did receive um, everything that I wanted on my list, which is fantastic. It's probably the first time that it's ever happened to me. So we'll get started. We'll get started with the haul, and yeah, let me know what you guys um, are actually experiencing at your supermarket down in the comments. I'll be interested to know what everyone's going through at the moment. All right, let's get started. Hey, so here we go. To start off with, we got a loaf of bread. My favorite vanilla latte. This was only $11. I always only get this one here when it's on special. Otherwise, the smaller packets go on special for $3.50. I'll get those ones instead of these ones here when they alternate going on special. I got two packets of tissues. I got Windex, multi-purpose spray. I got a nighttime wrinkle cream. I love the daytime one, so I wanted to try the nighttime one. I picked up some watermelon sour patches. I got a 100 tea bag box of Bushels tea. Yeah. I got some cordial. Three bottles of... Um, Peach iced tea, I absolutely love that. And I am actually going for surgery in a couple of weeks and I thought I would start stocking up on items and I need to prep before my keyhole surgery. Um, and tea, you can't have coffee, you can only have tea. Um, so I thought I would stock up on that. I picked up uh, two, I like these small containers um, of corn. Someone actually recommended a zucchini and corn fritters and my kids absolutely loved it. You know who you are. Um, absolutely loved it. So I thought I better cook some up, um, especially for after surgery. If I'm unable to meal prep, I'll, I'm going to put some fritters in the freezer and see how they go. So I thought I'll stock up on corn so I can make my fritters. And I actually made a, a tuna corn and cheese quesadilla on the cooktop yesterday and oh my Did goodness my, my kids mom. absolutely loved it i picked up four bottles of soy milk my daughter is uh has an allergy to dairy cheese and uh, nuts so she goes through these quite a bit this was one that i had to pick an alternative i normally get the so good yeah, you do. Ha no, I know. I know. We've got normal milk too, Christian. Yeah, <laughs> he doesn't like the soy milk. Um, yeah, so this was one of the alternatives. I don't know. I don't normally get vanilla soy. I normally get so good. Um, but I was happy with that. This will last her about a week. I got normal milk, normal full cream milk, and I got a little treat for me. Um, yes, we won't go there. I got one of these uh, sour creams. You can take a guess at what we're having for dinner tonight as we continue on. <laughs> I got one of these mozzarellas. Um, we are actually getting a pizza oven and fireplace put in our outdoor area. The bricks have been ordered. So I need to start mastering my pizza making skills. Um, and I want to try, I normally use the mozzarella but I want to try um, this cut up in slices on the pizza and see. Sorry, that's just my daughter knocking everything down. Um, cutting these up, cutting this up and seeing how it turns out on the pizza rather than the mozzarella. Uh, so I've got this mozzarella. I don't normally get this mozzarella. I normally get the Coles brand. So this was the other alternative that I had to um, select, which I was completely fine. I didn't want to have to go out and get mozzarella and I was just happy to pay a couple extra dollars to get this one here. I got one of these soft taco kits. I'm going to make that tonight. 
and I alternate um, making this with beef mince or chicken strips um, but yeah, tonight we're just going to make it with beef mince um, but I use this whatever I've got on hand I'll use um, the seasoning that's in this I picked up two cucumbers these cherry tomatoes that don't look very ripe so they'll probably take a few days for me to start yeah. eating it all right I picked up two tomatoes I need to actually make sure I just pick two tomatoes I'm sure I picked more but anyhow that's fine I'm happy with just the two I tend to go during the week to stock up on more veggies and fruit yeah. anyhow I picked up a head of iceberg lettuce you know my thoughts on iceberg lettuce I picked I got four, uh, what are these? Oh my God, Pink Lady. I don't know why I just went blank for a second there. I normally get Golden Delicious, but they didn't have, um, they were out at Coles. Um, so I went for the Pink Lady instead. I got some sweet potatoes. I normally make sweet potato chips. You know what my daughter's like with cherry tomatoes. She absolutely loves it. <laughs> Um, uh, yeah, I make sweet potato chips with them. Uh, I'm going to do a roast chicken during, on the weekend. So, that will go with that. I got two punnets of blueberries. These are $3.50 each. I could not believe it. Um, yeah, so I'll pick those up. My son absolutely loves raspberries. Yeah, you opened it up. Um, my son absolutely loves raspberries. Um, raspberries but they're seven dollars a punnet and I'm not willing to spend that much at the moment um, on raspberries oh Sarah I picked up uh, some broccoli zucchini obviously to make my fritters <laughs> Are you right, Bella? Hey. I'm almost done I got one of these watermelons. I know they're not in season at the moment, but I just can't go past a watermelon. You right? Yeah. <laughs> um, next, I picked up a 500 gram of beast mint. This will go with my um, Mexican tonight. I picked up two cheese and macaronis this will just go in the freezer just for after my surgery um i can just pull this out and make myself a quick lunch i got some dim sims that i steam in my steam in my rice steamer and i steam these in there yeah so i got those Pop them in the freezer we don't have these we haven't had these for months so yeah i'll pop them in the freezer and yeah pull them out i put them straight into the uh steamer frozen i picked up some of these vegetable spring rolls uh just popping them in the oven frozen for i think i put it in for half an hour or 45 minutes i can't remember but yeah, they're a good treat um, for the kids. And yeah, if I really can't be bothered cooking lunch one day, I just put this in the oven. And yeah, my kids love this. Um, obviously, I'll cut up some vegetables. But yeah, I absolutely love that. And last, or not lastly, I picked up turkey breast and ham off the bone. And the holy grail of toilet paper. I picked up uh this i was down to my last three so this was much needed um and i just get this brand here we actually love this not because of the price but because you actually like the toilet paper and my husband is very fussy with toilet paper so this is oh he got into the lolly so this is my haul um it, yeah i think it was 197 dollars it's hard to believe but yeah, I think I did pretty well. I'm sure if I go to the fruit market to buy the, the fruit and veggies, um, it'll be a lot cheaper. But yeah, it was just convenience uh, for this trip and I don't actually want to go out very much. So 
And you know how it is with kids. It's always a bit crazy. Alrighty, so that's the haul. Hopefully you enjoyed seeing what I got. Um, I know there's not much um, like meats and chickens, but I've got my freezer full, so I didn't need any this time round. Um, so yeah, let me know what you thought of this haul. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, leave me a comment down below um, what your calls is like and um, if it's hard for you to get deliveries with all the items that you actually want. So yeah, I'll leave it at that. I am going to attempt to do another haul of a redo of a Target haul. So keep an eye out for that video as well. I'm not sure if it's gonna go before, up before this video or after this video, but know that that was a retake of a video I did last week and I just didn't like the quality. So yeah. Anyhow, hopefully everyone has a, lo a lovely day and I'll see everyone in my next video. Bye.